It's the remains of a huge creature. Looks like a panel. He's very tall, or I'm very short. I wish I didn't keep thinking of the term bite size. Please be friendly. I hope you're friendly. I'm certainly friendly. Let's all be friends. Laham <laughs> chiadnak trestalum kalatisia nea um eklash park. How does it feel to be alive again after all these years? I can't believe I said something so lame. Laham Chiadnak Trestalum. Who are you? Kalatisia Nea Um. What are those ghosts that were giving us hints now and then? Kalatisia Nea Um. Well, hey, thanks. It's been great talking to you. So long. We should do this again sometime. I'd better tell Maggie about this. Maggie. Come in, Maggie. Yes? What? Maggie, you won't believe what just happened. Boston, I think I've got it. I've got the language. I can read this stuff now. Can you speak it? Because I've got this... But take this inscription here. I'm pretty sure it's talking about... Maggie? My mind must be playing tricks on me. What were you saying about... Ah! What are you? What do you want? What's happening? What's going on? Boston! Brink! Anybody! Maggie! Brink! Come in! Wherever you are, we need you! Something's happened to Maggie! Damn. What are you doing here, Lo? I don't want you here. Something happened to Maggie. She needs our help. Then go help her. What I'm doing here is important. Hey, if we felt that way about you, you'd still be dead. You're the tough guy, Lo. You're the hero. Go do your hero activities and let me do the science. think you're doing? Go away. I can't be any clearer.
Come on, guys. Let's get a look at you. No! Go away! You thief! Give those back! I will, Brink. After you help me find Maggie. I'm not going to waste one moment on such a meaningless task. Yes, you will, Brink. If you ever want these life crystals back. You're a miserable bully, Low. Typical military mind. Pushing other people around. Right. So follow me and do as you're told. Is that rational enough for you? Maggie! Is that you? Are you alright? Oh... How can she be alright? She's bound up in that web! This guy is big and nasty. Smells pretty bad, too. It looks like a grate sealing something off. Drink. Unless we want to end up where Maggie is, we've got to get by this thing. The obvious plan is for one of us to distract him while the other one slips by. Maybe you are thinking about it, Brink. You want to sneak or distract? I'll be the diversion. You phlegm, carapace, slime-faced, mucus-brained, furry-legged abductor of luminously intelligent but pulchritudinous earth women. No, you idiot! Why are you standing there? I'm still trying to figure out what you're saying. Move your silly buttocks, you fool! Austin, where are you going? I'm over here. Don't leave me. Where were you? This monster has me trapped. What have you been doing? Playing explorer while the monster chases poor Brink? I'm trying to figure out how to get that monster out of here. Boston, where are you going? I'm over here. Don't leave me.
water is pouring through that hole at a tremendous rate. At this point, I'm ready to try any damn thing. I think the water I diverted from the waterfall is flowing right to that grate. It won't accomplish anything. It won't accomplish anything. I can't use these two things together. a grate down by Maggie. If you can lure the monster over toward you, then when Maggie unclogs the grate, the water I diverted will hit it like a fire hose. This is seriously your plan? Do you have a better one? Maggie, can you get the grate open? Has anybody thought of the fact that if it does stop water like a fire hose, I'm right here? That's a good point, Maggie. Hold on tight. How do I hold on tight when I'm unclogging a grate? That's why you get the big bucks. Do it then. Just do it. It's only my life anyway. Come on, you ponderous exoskeleton. You cocoon-eating lobster face, cave-dwelling, arthropoidal, elementary sphincter muscle! Maggie, you made it. How's my hair? You're worried about your... I was joking, Boston. You know, like you strong, manly types do when you just about get killed. Maggie's safe now. I satisfied our little deal. So give me my crystals and let me get back to work. Brink, it's time for us to work together on... I said give them to me! Take one more step closer, Maggie, and you'll wish you were back with that giant lobster. He sure is weird. Now what? I've been getting the feeling that the ghosts want us to help them. As if they were stuck and wanted out. Stuck how? Well, the library console seemed to indicate that they may have left this world for another. What if they want to come back, but can't? I don't know. How will we go about helping, assuming that's what they want, and they wouldn't need us when they got back? Beats me. I'm just interpreting.
Look at it, Maggie. It shimmers, but it doesn't seem real. A kind of light that's just on the edge of existence. Something like this. You'd think they would have written about it somewhere. They've written about every other phenomenon here. Can you look at this inscription, Maggie? Does it say anything that might help? It wasn't clear to me before, but now I can see. Boston, it exactly describes that strange field of almost light. What does it say? It's a set of instructions. Now it makes perfect sense. I just twist this. Everything's so simple when you read the directions. If we didn't know better, we'd think that island had been there for a million years. This island was brought back from another dimension. What was so important that they left us exact instructions on how to get here? Maybe that metal plate over there. That's the fourth one. If it's like the metal plates on Attila, these four should fit together in that triangle matrix. Yes, but there's no guarantee that putting them together will take us anywhere we want to go. You have the most cheerful thoughts, Ms. Robbins. If you had been abducted by a monster and then half drowned, you might be pessimistic too. But you lived, didn't you? And your hair looks terrific again. You sure know how to make a girl feel good. We better go find Brink again. In case these metal plates do the job. He threatened to kill me the last time I saw him. Maybe it would be safer if we leave him and send an expedition back to get him later. An armed expedition. There's no guarantee we'll ever get back. For all we know, this is a one-way trip. You're right. We can't leave him. He scares me, Boston. Worse than the monster. They're both just hungry for something. But Brink is smarter, more dangerous. We're smart, too. Let's go. That was a powerful one. Commander Lowe! Can you hear me? Brink, we're looking for you. We've got the last of the metal plates and we... Listen to me, Commander. I'm trapped. I need your help. Where are you? It's near one of the light bridges. An arch bridge over a waterfall and then into a crevice in the rock. You must have been there. You're the one who's been turning on all the light bridges, aren't you? Hold tight. We're on our way. Hold tight? Very funny. won't do it. Robbins. 
What if I hadn't noticed that inscription and taken it with me? We could have wandered around here until we died without ever finding that island. They hide it. Then they help us find it. Who can understand why aliens do what they do? Maybe it's a test of our intelligence. Or maybe it's a test of our dumb luck. Or our persistence. When I called you before you were kidnapped, I was trying to tell you that it worked. I revived the alien. Was it angry? Glad? He didn't kill me, if that's what you mean. He talked to me, but I didn't understand anything he said. Thanks. <laughs>